make greatest and smallest numbers no digits to be repeated now what does this mean let's say for example you have certain number of digits and uh, i'll take four of them so let's say you have seven nine three and one okay and i tell you to make the greatest four digit number and the smallest four digit number the condition is that none of these digits no digits so these are all digits to be repeated so if i have to make a four digit number so let's say it is like one two three four i can use each one of these digits only once and the same applies for the smallest four digit number as well now if i make a four digit number please try to understand this this is what ones place let me maybe use a different color this is tens place this is hundred place and this is thousandth place right so tell me which one of these four is greater what is the value which is greater one 10 100 or 1000 obviously you will say what a stupid question is this 1000 is greater than 100 it is greater than tens it is greater than ones right so if i have to take one of these digits right and put it in thousands place then what will i do i will pick up the largest digit why because it let's say for example if i put 7 here Vis a vis a situation where I put nine here, here the number that I will get will be seven thousand something something, right? Here the number which I will get is nine thousand something something. So therefore, what I do is I pick up the largest number and put it down at the thousandth place. Nine. Now once I have used nine, I can't use it again because the condition is no digits to be repeated, right? Now I come to hundred, and I'm left with seven, three, and one. Which is the largest of these three? Seven, right? Just like the logic I applied here. For a moment, assume which will be the digit if I have to put in here. Obviously, it should again be the larger one, right? Because let's say, for example, if I put in seven here, what I will get is seven hundred something something, right? whereas if instead of 7 i put in 3 over here what will i get i will get 300 something and we all know that 700 and whatever number it might be is greater than 300 our idea is to get the greatest number right so we will plot the maximum value over here now again even 7 is gone coming to the tens place what do i have i have 3 and 1 which one is bigger 3 because i want the greatest number so i will put 3 over here and in the ones place there is only one digit which is left so i will put 1 over here so using these four numbers which is 7 9 3 & 1 the greatest number that i can form is 9731 and what is the process i follow i pick up the largest number put it at the beginning or the thousandth place then i put put up the second largest number in the second place third in the third and fourth in the fourth you can try as many combinations as you want but you will not get a number which is greater than this number by following these four digits now let's talk about the smallest one again the same thing applies right so this is the thousand place this is the hundredth place this is the tens place and this is the ones place Okay, let me complete this. Thousand, hundred. Now my idea is to put get the smallest four-digit number, right? If I put in nine over here, what will I get? I will get a nine thousand something number, right? And if I put in one over here, 
what will I get? I will get 1000 something. You know which is the smallest of these two? Is it 1000 whatever that number is or is it 9000? It is obviously 1000. Why? Because now our objectives are different. We want the smallest number. So what I will do is I'll pick up the smallest of the digits out of these four, right? Which is one and I will put it in thousandths place, right? Once one is gone, which is the second smallest number? It's three. So I will put three over here. I can't use seven or nine because the moment I use seven, I will get 700, 1700 something. And we know 1700 is greater than 1300. So we will not use seven over here. We use three, right? Similarly, then I put on seven because seven is smaller out of these two. And I put it in tens place. Whatever remains, I put it at once. So in order to form the smallest number, what do I do? I pick up the smallest one, keep it to the extreme left. In this case, it is thousand. Even if it was hundred thousand, million, ten million, lakhs, crores, whatever that might be, we'll put it over here. Then we pick up the second smallest, pick up the third smallest, pick up the fourth smallest. And that's how we form this number. I hope you would have understood this. Thank you for being with us today.